Hi, today I'm going to show you a couple of uh, percentage increase and decrease questions uh, using decimal multipliers. So here are the three steps then that you need to follow then. Uh, the first step then is to add or subtract your percentage to or from 100%. So if you're doing a percentage increase question you add the percentage to 100. If you're doing a percentage decrease you take away the percentage from 100. Uh, the second step then is you need to divide the percentage by 100. So this will give you the decimal multiplier. And then the third and final step then is to multiply the amount by this decimal multiplier. So let's apply these three steps to the two examples here. So example one then, we've got to increase £309 by 27%. So since we're doing a percentage increase, we need to add the percentage on to 100. So we do 100% plus 27%, which is 127%. So the next step, step two, is we need to convert this percentage into a decimal. And we do that by dividing it by 100. So we work out 127 divided by 100, which is 1.27. And this is our decimal multiplier. So our third and final step then is to multiply the money by our decimal multiplier. So we do 309 times by 1.27. And if you just get your calculator now and work that one out. So if we do 309 times 1.27, uh, we get an answer of £392.43. So let's move on to example 2 then. So this time we need to do a decrease and we've got to decrease £96 by 12%. So since it's a decrease then we need to subtract our percentage away from 100. So we do 100 take away 12 which gives us 88%. So the second step then is to convert this percentage into a decimal. So you do that by dividing by 100. So 88 divided by 100 is 0.88. So again, this is our decimal multiplier. So the third and final step then is to multiply the amount by the decimal multiplier. So if we do 96 times 0.88, this gives us an answer of £84.48. Thanks for watching.